You're listening to Soap Dirt, the latest in television entertainment news. Hey there, YNR fans. It is Belinda from Soap Dirt, and I have got your early edition spoilers for the week of Monday, September 18th through Friday, September 22nd. I've got undated spoilers for the week, but they are really exciting. And just real quick, though, I'm going to tell you about what's going to happen the rest of this week. Recording this now, we're in the evening of Tuesday, September 12th. So you guys will most likely be watching this Wednesday, September 13th or later. So I'm going to pick up on Wednesday just real quick. Abby wants to know from Tucker, where is my mom? And he's like, she's in Paris. And he's like, it didn't work out. He says he's sick of the Abbots and he kicks her out. Then he goes downstairs and picks up Audra from the GCAC bar, takes her upstairs and they bang. Actually, he goes upstairs, then she shows up, then they bang. At any rate, definitely looks like his marriage is over. Sharon sees Chance Chancellor and Summer Newman kind of have a vibe together And Sharon's with Chance when Summer walks up on them. Summer's clearly crushing on him, and he's kind of sort of paying a little bit of attention. Victor takes over as CEO, and Victoria is really angry. She goes and bangs Nate and then immediately starts plotting. After Esther disses Adam, Nikki reads him for filth and accuses him of plotting against Victor, but Adam seems to be sincere. He heads to Newman Enterprises, and he repeats to Nikki and Victor that he's very sincere about starting from the bottom and proving himself to everyone. All right, we are going to dig into more, but if you haven't already, please reach out and click subscribe so you don't miss any of our wine our updates. Thursday, September 14th, Tucker and Audra cut a deal. Interested to see what that is about. And Jack calls the Abbots together. There's lots to talk about. He and Diane have set a date for their wedding reception. And Diane has already heard this, I think, but she knows that Ashley is gone, but Tucker is back. And it seems like things headed south fast with that marriage. Lily Winters talks to Daniel about Heather. I'm thinking she's kind of jealous. And then the weekends on Friday the 15th with Audra changing things with Kyle. I have to suspect at least in part it's because she slept with Tucker. And Tucker comes clean to Devon, but I'm sure it's not about Audra. I would doubt that he would come clean about that. I instead think it's going to be about what happened in Paris and why he got so upset that he left Ashley there. But then on Friday, Ashley makes a distress call. So did Tucker do something to her or stash her somewhere or did something happen to her after he left? I'm very interested to find out. All right, then going into the week that starts Monday, September 18th, we have Phyllis Summers making a risky deal. Well, mm, that sounds like most of the deals that Phyllis makes. I mean, she married that villain while she was faking her death. So I, I just struggle to think of any deal that she makes that's not risky. So I have a couple of theories on this spoiler. One is maybe Adam really is conspiring against the Newmans and he gets Phyllis involved with him. She's always down for a good scheme and she and Adam have worked well together in the past. Or it could be Tucker making a deal with her. I do know that Phyllis wants to interfere in Summer's love life to try and get her back with Kyle and with Daniel's love life to try and get him back with Heather. Maybe it's something about that. There's, it's hard to ever pin down exactly the nature of Phyllis's schemes because she's always just involved in so many. That's why I like her. She's a whole lot of fun. All right. Victor loses his patience with Victoria next week. Oh, I bet he does. Victoria is furious. As far as she is concerned, she has done everything that daddy ever asked. And she's daddy's little girl and she should be CEO. And he just booted her out of that seat and took the throne for himself. And she's on a seat at the child's table, aka being co-CEO, which means co-nothing because Victor's going to keep all the power. 
And it's funny because Victoria was upset wondering he was if he was going to bring Adam back in as her co-CEO. I think at this point she might prefer that to what's been done to her, that she's the co-CEO. At least if Adam was her co-CEO, she could kick him around and torment him. And I think Victor is going to be ruling with an iron fist and Victoria's days of unlimited power and crapping on whoever she wants to are over. And I am so there for it. I'm really excited about these episodes. And I think we're going to see Victoria engaged in a plot that would be worthy of Adam. I almost wonder if she might plot with Adam. That would be a whole heck of a lot of fun, you know? All right. Nikki has a difficult task for Audra Charles. She's already given her the difficult task of not betting Kyle. So I'm wondering what Audra's CEO at Newman Media is demanding of her. And I also wonder if Tucker and Audra might be plotting about Newman Media now. I don't even know. With Audra back in Tucker's orbit, I feel like that crap's going to get real and it's going to get real fast. I'm excited to see them make some trouble for these legacy families. It sounds like soapy fun. We also have Lily Winters finding out something that disturbs her. So the week we're in right now, on the 14th, she says some stuff to Daniel about Heather. I mean, she's uncomfortable, clearly, about all this. But I think that her finding out something that disturbs her has to be something about Daniel. Maybe this is part of Phyllis's plot. I don't know, but I liked Lily and Daniel. I liked that they were, you know, high school sweeties and everything before she got involved with Kane. I I enjoy their vibe. I do like Vail Bloom as Heather, but I kind of want to see Daniel with Lily. Hey, you guys, let me know what you think about these spoilers. Who do you think Phyllis is making a deal with? What do you think Victoria does to make Victor snap on her? What task do you think Audra sets for, that Nikki sets for Audra? And what do you think Lily's going to find out. Let us know what you would like to see in the comments below. If you enjoyed these early edition spoilers, please click a like and definitely click subscribe so you don't miss any of our Young and the Restless updates. Thank you guys so much for listening. I appreciate it. This has been Belinda from Soap Dirt. Thank you for being a loyal listener. Follow us wherever you get your podcast because you don't want to miss the next episode. Soap Dirt is on all the major podcast platforms, including Apple Podcasts, Spotify, iHeartRadio, and more.